Your is get your ass, your boys. I'm back here with another video. And in this video today, guys, we're going to be doing a gameplay of the new Pink Diamond Free Kyle Corver in NBA 2K24. My team. As you guys can see, the Evo is 25 three-pointers. How to get Kyle Corver? Well, you do have to go in here and grind out all of these level-up agendas. 200 rebounds with power forwards over multiple multiplayer games takes forever. As well as the 300 points in the paint with small forwards over multiplayer games. Those are the, game, uh, those are the things that take forever. Getting 50 blocks and 100 three-pointers with shooting guards really wasn't super bad, but the multiplayer stuff took forever. Now, what does this Evo do? Well, gives him a few more badges. You guys can see right stick ripper, fast feet, spin cycle, scooper, hall of fame glove, gets gold clamps, gets a lot of those defensive upgrades, as well as speed, lateral quickness, field ball acceleration goes way up, and the steel perimeter and interior. Again, Evo 75 threes, did it quickly in triple threat offline, was relatively easy to do. Now, this is the finalized Kyle Corver, what he does indeed look like, 6'7", 98 three ball, low driving dunk, 86 ball handle, defensively 80, 90 steel perimeter, 85 interior, decent speed, lateral quickness, 18 out of famers, including limitless range, as well as glove. The problem I see with Kyle Corver is this. There's no playmaking badges with this card. No, you know, handles for days. No quick first step. None of those things. And I think that's going to hold the card back a little bit. Look at him, Mr. Corver here in shoot around. I mean, movement wise, has the MJ dribble style as far as his SIGs in general. They're not bad. My whole thing is this, no handles for days though. That's gonna really hurt the card. Release wise, one of the best in the entire game. So the pros are there, but the cons are definitely there too. As far as a spot up shooter, I don't think it's gonna get much better than Kyle Corver. So even a guy to take in like triple threat offline, there's gonna be no better guy to take to knock down threes than this guy right here. Even in clutch time, I think this card has the potential to be super valuable because of the way he shoots the ball. I just don't think he's great defensively. He's fine. He's just not great and I just feel like offensively look he is going to be able to shoot the ball at an elite level but is that enough to sacrifice defense and playmaking because alongside Kyle Corver, you're gonna need to run a point guard that's able to get a bucket and that definitely is worrisome you guys can see what the dunk meter looks like as well just so small outside of shooting the ball and the curry slide I don't know how much Kyle Korver truly gives you on the court. Now, normally, guys, I do like doing my gameplays in my team unlimited, but there is something about this Kyle Korver that I think is going to be special in clutch time, and so that's where we're heading first today. And again, primary boy handler, no, that's not going to be what he does, but I'm running him alongside, yo, chill, what is going on? Running him alongside Eamon Tom, chill, okay, I do not like him dribbling the ball. I'm running him next side, next side, uh, I'm running a, a Men Thompson right next to him to, to hopefully make Kyle Corver be that man offensively. First possession of the game, he grains an open shot. I love it, right? Get him involved in that pick and pop early and often and you are gonna have great success. Now let's try to use him as a primary ball handler here. No handles for days, no quick first steps. So those are just some things that you guys are gonna need to notice. Okay, walk back, Corver. Oh my goodness, Kyle Corver walking back for a green? I see you. The defense didn't know if they wanted to switch that or not. They were in a bind. Kyle Corver makes him pay. Defense so far looking like it's enough. Not going to sit here and gas it, but definitely is looking like, you know, he's playing enough defense at least to get by. Find the corner. You're blinking, dude. He's blinking. He's not going to make it when he's blinking. And boom, right there, no handles for days. You are seeing what I'm talking about and why it's such an issue. It's about the only move Corver can do right there. Simple, easy, quick. That's the. Uh, those are the types of moves you need to do with Kyle Corver offensively. Get him in a pick and pop again. Back to him. Green. One more. Swing. We're good. Four seconds. Three, two, one. LeBron James straight to the rim. Great defense. Board, board, board hit him. He's open. It's got to be green. And it is. Anytime you shoot it open with Corver, you know what color it's going to come up as. Green like Kyle Corver. Corver for four. That's too deep. 
too deep, not open, but I wanted to try it. Get a little bit out of my comfort zone. That's fine. I'll, I'll live with that shot. Yes, I'm in. He's so tired all the time. Like, I hope y'all seeing what I'm meaning. Like, he is so tired all the time because he doesn't have handles for days. So anytime you dribble the ball with him, he is blinking. Great. Can't do that. You can't do that. In, in, at, at that at, in some positions, guys, you just got to give up the dunk. You cannot give up a Corver Green. No way, right? Board, run. Run, a man, run, a man, run, a man. Only move you can do, Corver. I did too much. I did too much. He still grained it, though. If it's open, it's green. Corver defensively? Okay, Kyle Corver. That's a great defensive stop right there. I see y'all. Hit him. Ah, he was open, too. I wanted to green that. My opponent had enough of Kyle Corver, and I would have too. Did y'all see Corver moving and grooving right there? Now, again, playmaking, a little bit of an issue. We are going to hop into triple threat online with Wemby, with the guy that can make some plays. Let's just go Kobe and see if Kyle Corver can hoop in triple threat online. My opponent here has a decent squad. Kawhi, AK, and Chet. I can't hate on that type of a squad. Corver. My man said he almost threw Roy Hibbert, man. I don't need to win, so I'ma just hook with Corver, and at the end of this game, I'll give him the win, man. Corver! Corver! <laughs> Corver! Oh my god. Hold up. Are y'all seeing what Corver doing, man? Or is it just me? I mean, look at what he doing. <laughs> he doing it all right now. Switch, jump. That's the hit Corver. Hit Corver. Gotta be open. I'm shooting it. I'm shooting it! Kyle Corver, you better start stepping up. I mean, he just put so much pressure on the defense. Too deep, it's Kyle Corver. Okay. I mean, okay. Are we seeing the same thing? Look, look, look. I might have to, I might have to issue a public apology. I missed it. I might have to issue a public apology, man. I might have to. Because what and I'm missing some shots here. But what I'm seeing, man, is a guy that wants to come out here and hoop. That's what I'm seeing. Curry, Curry slide, Kyle Corver green light. Say he watching videos close to Roy, man. I don't want to ruin greatness. I don't want to ruin greatness. <laughs> Kyle Corver green light is too much. Stat badge wise, this card needs to be better. 2K did a bad job. I mean, 40 total badges when Dr. J base badges has 65 is ridiculous. But this card, because of his release, is one of you know the easiest cards to use in the entire game. Do I think he's a top five shooting guard in the game? No, I don't because his defense isn't great. And I think, you know, he leaves a lot to be desired in that playmaking category. But there's no question about it. If you're looking for an easy guy to use and, an, and just the guy with a smooth, easy to time release, easy offline player to use, Kyle Corver's your guy. Is he worth the grind? Man, I don't know. I don't know. The grind takes a long time. I can't sit here and lie to you. I do not think Corver's worth it. But he is an easy, easy card to use. And definitely a card that could help my no money spent squad. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. And as always, man, I love you guys. Have a blessed day.